Hello, I'm Patrick Reams with ComTech Advisory. Welcome back to our latest episode of Conversations with Leaders in CTRM Technology. Very pleased today to have with us Ms. Wendy Orlando, VP of the uh, Trade and Risk Group at uh, Enverus. Wendy, thanks for being here. Thanks, Patrick. Glad Absolutely. to be here. For those that aren't familiar with Enverus, uh, formerly Drilling Info, can you give us a quick overview of the trading and risk offerings that, that Enverus has? Yeah, so our trading and risk suite really is composed of four main offerings. Mm -hmm. um, Market View, who I think everybody's heard of, which is really our flagship um, data aggregation and visualization tool, mm -hmm. along with our curve building and monitoring tool, our enterprise data management, and then rounding out, which is really our differentiator, is our PRT and power fundamentals. Mm -hmm. And also fundamentals in oil and gas and just fundamentals you know, in the energy space. Right, right. Um, <coughs> obviously one of the key differentiators for a, a company like Everest is in data and data management. Um, uh, what are the, what's the scope of the, the market view capabilities in terms of aggregating data, internal data, external data? Um, and, and what do you see as the, the ultimate value of that solution? Right, so we feel like we want to provide our users a very easy way to get data into our system, mm -hmm. to be able to view, analyze, digest that information. Mm -hmm. And we see, you know, regardless of what the type of information it is, it could be market data, it could be personal data, it could be fundamentals, it could be company-wide data, but really what differentiates us is market view. So mm -hmm. being able to take all that data and have visualization on top of it, yeah. all in a single solution. Yeah, and, and speaking of data <coughs> visualization, I mean, we've always at ComTech felt that data visualization was an overlooked capability within a lot of these data management products. A lot of people had to go outside and, and look for third-party solutions in order to do that. I understand you guys have been working hard to create some very rich and interesting and, and uh, intelligent ways of viewing data. Can you give us an update on that, that uh, process and effort? Yeah, as you know, with our market view solution, it's always been important um, graphics and being able to um, visualize people's prices, people's information. Now we've integrated our curve builder, so now you can also see your cur your forward curves on these graphs and charts. And the next thing that we're really thinking about that we're going out and validating with customers is in reference to maps. Mm -hmm. What problems are they trying to solve? What value would maps bring to our solution? And so that's really our next step, our next progression in 2020. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, if we look at uh, data management, uh, data an analytics uh, across the industry, we find that these solutions tend to get kind of siloed because for analysts to use these, they almost have to have coder-like skills. Right. And that can be very difficult for the average user to do. So again, these, these applications tend to get a bit so, uh, siloed within right. that organization at that particular point. Uh, what are you guys doing to, to kind of solve that issue and make data and data analytics more accessible across the organization? So in 2020, our main focus is on user experience. Mm -hmm. So, you know, easier ways for users to be able to digest this data, to be able to use this data. And one thing with forward curves is we find that it becomes almost a developer tool. Right. And so we want to bring the tool back to the users, to the traders, to the risk analysts, to the people who need it. So we're increasing the user experience, mm -hmm. making it very easy to use from the front end, drag and drop mm -hmm. um, functions, as well as a curve wizard. Mm -hmm. So imagine you're a new user, you haven't built curves before, it will take you through how to build a curve. Mm -hmm. Or say you're an existing user and you're getting into a new market. We'll also say, okay, you're getting into the power market, you've been in the gas market, here's some example curves that may be a starting place for you to go and build your own curves. Mm -hmm. So that's really um, an important focus for us in 2020. Okay, good. Um, when we look at, at the marketplace, and there, there aren't a ton of, of players in the data and data analytics space, but there, there's enough that right. it, it's sometimes difficult to differentiate yourself. How is, how is Embrus differentiating your offerings? Right. As I think about us in comparison to the other tools that go out and build curves or have enterprise data management, it's really two key things. And the first one is our market view solution, which we're constantly adding data 
We have the largest amount of energy data mm -hmm. that anybody has and the focus on visualization within that solution. Mm -hmm. And the second thing is really rounding it out with fundamentals. So you can view and you can utilize our fundamentals through that tool. So it's a total integrated solution mm -hmm. and those are the things that really differentiate us. I mean, nobody does that. Right. And so we have a complete solution that no one else has in the space. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Well, I appreciate it. Uh, that's unfortunately all the time we have for today, but I appreciate you coming by. Thanks, it was to good. See nice to see you too, Patrick. <laughs> all right, take care. Uh, so that's it for us at uh, Comtech Advisory in our latest episode of uh, Conversations with Leaders in CTRM. Uh, for additional videos like this, podcasts, research reports, blogs, and, and news on the commodity trading industry, uh, please see the CTRMcenter.com or our corporate website at comtechadvisory.com. Thanks a lot. <laughs>